Transactional Analysis Part 1 Structural Analysis The transactional analysis was created by Eric Byrne, a Canadian-born psychiatrist. It is a way to explain human behavior. The theory is based on the ideas of Freud, but it's distinctly different. Byrne believed that insight in patients' personality could be better discovered by analyzing a patient's social transactions. The most important basic assumptions the transactional analysis makes are first, everyone is born okay. Second, every person has the ability to think. And third, Everyone is responsible for themselves, which means he or she decides on his or her own destiny and can also change such decisions. Related to the question why people think, act and interact as they do, Byrne found that the human brain works like a camcorder. It records all our feelings, thoughts and emotions which we tend to replay in our adult life. All that support the development of a consistent pattern of feeling and experience that is directly related to a corresponding pattern of behavior. So, what is a transaction? A transaction is the fundamental unit of social intercourse. That means a certain behavior or better response follows a stimulus. If two or more people encounter each other, sooner or later one of them will speak or give some other indication of acknowledging the presence of the others. Another person will then say or do something, which is in some way related to the stimulus. For more information, psychological theories and interesting coaching tools, please go to our website.